and welcome to another weekly vlog. This is my very first week out of drama school. Madness. I have recovered uh, from last week. If you saw last week's weekly vlog when I basically cried the whole time. If you haven't, I'll put a card thing up here. Go check it out. It's, uh, it's an emotional one. Today I am recording my vocal reel. Um, with Vocal Reel of London, I will put all their links in the description box below. Um, if you're looking for a Vocal Reel, go check them out. So I'm excited for that. I'm a bit nervous, like I don't know what to expect. I've never recorded a singing reel before, so I'll take you along for the journey and hopefully be able to film a few bits and, and show it to you and all that kind of stuff. Don't want to go along with the crowd Don't want my spirit broken and bowed Why should I have to hide? To live out loud Don't want to be alone in the crowd I only want what I'm not allowed I've been a terrible, terrible vlogger I didn't vlog at all yesterday, did I? Today is Tuesday and again, I have a really busy day so I'm not sure how much I'm going to be able to film I thought this would be such a great vlog First week out of drama school, I have so much to do Turns out they're all things that I can't really film and therefore this is just a bit boring. <laughs> I am heading off for a house viewing in Balham. Um, I'm currently moving, as you saw yesterday, this is like the state of my room. So I'm currently house hunting for end of August, early September. I'm going back to my parents for like eight weeks over the summer um, to save money, essentially. While I don't need to be in central London and I'm only half an hour out, I may as well. And then I'm going for brunch with my friend Megan, who I'm moving in with in September. You'll see Megan in a vlog very soon. We recorded a Let's Talk Drama School about drama school and university and the differences between the two. Um, and that is coming up in August, I think. That's, we filmed that a while ago, but I just haven't, I keep scheduling it back for other, th like to fit in with other things. This afternoon, I have a day of role play. And um, do I have time to talk about this now? Yes, I do, I have five minutes. So role play is, Something I only learnt about at Central, and it is just, like, such a great way for actors to earn money. Before I go into what role play is, I'll have a quick chat about what drama school prepares you for. And I say this having gone through a term of actors research with um, our teacher Emma, who is insanely clever and amazing at, like, all of these kind of things. Um, so from Central, I didn't have this experience, but from speaking to other friends from other schools, I think drama school prepares you so much for when you are an actor and working as an actor, but it doesn't put into account that actors only work for a certain percentage of the year and for so many weeks and months, I mean, obviously this isn't for everyone, but for so many weeks and months when you're out of work, it just doesn't help prepare you for that and for keeping creative and alive during that time. But Emma has taught us about role play, which is essentially where you go into um, like corporates or charities and I'm going into a school today, so schools. You get given a brief with a character and a scenario and you go in as the, as the character, like you're, you're an actor but you're not, you don't go in as Sophie, like as soon as the people in the workshop see you, you are like a certain character. Um, so, yeah, you go in, you improvise out the scenario from the brief, um, they'll often like shout freeze and then the delegates will have like a chat about what they've seen and what they would do differently and then they'll go back into it and carry on with the scenario. So you're like workshopping with people. So like I've been given a character today um, of a school child. This is great for me because, you know, you can't get actual children to do these things but I look like one. Um, so yeah, I am going this afternoon to this school. I can't tell you more really about that, but. I just vlogged for about three minutes and didn't press record. I'm home from the role play. It went really well. Um, I had a great time. It's just such a cool job if you're out of acting work to like, I would look into it if I were you. My plan for the rest of today, it's like just coming up to five o'clock, is to finish packing. Like this is 
my life right now. Um, so I have an audition tomorrow morning at 10 and then I'm moving. Like my dad's coming up to get me around lunchtime. Um, my grandma doesn't live too far. I need to drop my camera. My grandma doesn't live too far from where I am in Swiss Cottage at the moment, so I think my dad's gonna go up and visit her and then come and collect me and all of my things and I'll move, 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 move. I'll be moving back to Surrey. Last feeling was alright this morning. Alright. Wasn't like a hundred percent what we were looking for. However, if we can't find anything else, it was nice. Um we still have time. So I'm not stressing so much, but I'll tell you what, house hunting is quite stressful. I'm trying to find it. Also trying to just arrange viewings is really hard, especially this week. Um, when there's like a lot of little things happening that take up time and take up the times when the estate agents can do viewings. Um, but hopefully we will find somewhere soon and as always I will keep you posted. Good morning, happy Wednesday. It's a new dawn. It's a new day. Today is moving day. I am excited. It's weird, like, moving back to my parents' house after a year, um, but it is only for like six, seven weeks. Today is not only moving day, but I have an audition this morning. It's currently half past eight in the morning. It's so early. Heading into school now to um, go and warm up, get some breakfast. breakfast from Starbucks. From cinnamon swirl because treat yourself. I'm gonna warm up. It's now like 10 to 9 so I have about 15-20 minutes. Just want to do a quick warm up, go through my songs and then I'm heading off. See you in a bit. 15 minutes later on the move again. It's so early. I haven't sung this early in a really long time. So because okay. Right. Off we go. All done. That went well. I'm pleased with how it went. Now it's just one of those things you just do and then don't think about. Or at least try not to think about. Now it's time to pack up my life. I have so much to do and I have about two hours. No, half eleven or twelve. I have about three hours until my dad gets here with the car to drive back down south of the river. Let's go. There we go, driving away from my flat. Whew. Tell you what, it's very hot and those are a lot of stairs and a lot of heavy things, but we did it. All packed in the back. Good game of Tetris there, Dad. Driving away back yeah. to Surrey for the summer. Morning and happy Thursday. I'm gonna go and have my breakfast in the garden. For breakfast this morning, I have some Alpro soya Greek style yogurt with strawberries and blueberries, half a cinnamon and raisin bagel. I don't know how I feel about the fact that you can only buy bagels pre-cut. I am gonna read Oh, I've nearly finished everything I know about love. If you remember a couple weeks ago, I started this in the vlog. I have this much left. So I'm going to sit here and enjoy my breakfast. Friday. I went to Wimbledon as you saw just now. After that I went to see Fiverr which is on at the um, the Little in the Southwark Playhouse and oh my god it was amazing so I just wanted to like come on here and have like a moment to talk about it. So it's a new musical by Alex James Ellison and Tom Lees and it was just like unbelievably good. About a five pound note that like travels through like different people's lives and 
um, it's a cast of five people and four of them multi-role and it's like so clever how they weave together the storylines and like the people that are multi-rolling how they kind of link stories oh it was just incredible um so if you have the chance it's on until the 20th of july so if you get the chance go and see it i have been the worst vlogger ever it's currently monday it's a new week we got our house well, Megan went and viewed a house on Friday and we put an offer in and after like a very stressful 24 hours waiting to see if our offer was accepted over another offer, we got it and I'm so excited. We are moving to southwest London in September. I'm so excited. It's such a lovely flat and I'm just very excited to live with Megan. We went to school together and we've been friends for like 10 years so I'm just very very excited. And then I've just had an email from an agency that I met with last week and auditioned for and they've offered me representation so I'm really excited about that. I'm going to have a think about it over the next couple of days but what a first week at a drama school. Vocal reel, first paid job as an actor and now an offer from an agent. Happy, happy days. Thank you so much for watching this weekly vlog. I will see you next week for a special Into the Woods throwback and also on Tuesday for my next Let's Talk Drama School video. Please subscribe to see all my future vlogs um, about my weekly vlogs as an actor, uh, some drama school videos over the summer about finding accommodation, that's the next one, budgeting for drama school, scholarships, all that kind of stuff. Um, so yeah, hit that subscribe button to keep up to date with my goings on in my life as a performer and I will see you next week.